Do you want to know how I did not make $3 million on a particular investment? Stick around to find out. So this chart in front of you, and I know some of you saw this before, is MILK, M-I-L-C, Millennium Sustainable Ventures Corp. It used to be called something else, Millennium Investment something something. And they were like in the business of, they had some investment in a Indian uh, brokerage a company and then they also had cash in the bank and then they also had like a operation in carbon like producing carbon uh, energy carbon uh, and so I was looking at, at it uh, somewhere somewhere at the end of uh, 2020 and I remember this specifically about 25 cents and it was uh, on on paper it was like a no-brainer they had like uh, 2 million market cap something like that um, anywhere you looked at it there was a huge margin of safety uh, so I was a very close to putting 100 grand into it. And 100 grand at 25 cents would have bought me 400,000 shares, okay? And, uh, but I never did make this investment. Uh, and then I saw, like, you know, in 2000, this thing, look at this, it went to $10. Ten dollars, okay. So at first I was like, I mean, look at this, look at this return from like twenty-five cents to ten dollars, almost four thousand, almost four thousand percent return. Uh, ten dollars divided by twenty-five, forty times, forty bagger, right? So. Do you, do you realize that that 400,000 shares would have been worth, you know, three, four million dollars? Four million dollars at the top, right? But why, why was this jump like this? Well, because they got into uh, a different type of business, cannabis business. And at that time, cannabis business was so hot that... People were bidding up everything cannabis, and this thing went literally to the moon, right? And now that enough time passed, look what happened to the stock price. Went from $10 to $0.10, cents, 99% down, $0.10. Cents. So <clears throat> if I invested at $0.25, cents, I would have looked like a genius. It would have gone to $4 million dollars. And if I wasn't smart enough to sell it at the top, which I wouldn't be because if I saw them getting into this new business, I know myself that I would have sold it. Uh, but let's just pretend. Let's just pretend that I would have been so smart and didn't, didn't sell it. And then let's pretend that I would have been stupid enough to hold on to it the entire time. So I would have seen a hundred thousand dollars go to four million so that it would go from four million to fifty thousand what it is today like even less than fifty thousand maybe like forty thousand that is just complete insanity okay but you know there's things out there that are gonna do this okay but they're not gonna come down okay when the liquidity returns there is things that are going to do this and they're not going to come back if they deliver, right? And another company I want to bring up is this, CLO, CLO Waste Management. And I talked about it when I talked about Aduro. So CLO in uh, 2021, look at this, reached $1.55 and now it's seven and a half cents. So it went from, it was a darling, it went from 
$1.55 to what it is today, 95% down. Now, at this level here, it had a market cap of more than a billion dollars. More than a billion dollars, okay? And now it did what it did because, because they failed. They, they failed to deliver on the promises uh, and, you know, it didn't work out. Now, if Aduro had that kind of uh, valuation of a billion dollars because, you know, uh, the liquidity is there and all sorts of things, then Aduro would have a stock because today the market cap is less than 50 million, but that's Canadian. But let's just ignore it for a second. Uh, Aduro would have a stock price of $20. Okay, $20. Now, I totally believe that if Aduro, you know, delivers on this technology, and I mean, I, I pretty much have a good idea whether they will deliver or not on the technology, but you can totally see something like this from Aduro, but without the down part in Aduro, uh, because I don't think that Aduro, you know, technology is fake or anything like that. Uh, but there is things out there is things out there that will do that will do both that will do this and this because this is a fake uh, fake uh, you know bump like on GameStop, AMC, uh, but there is things out there that are going to do this and they're going to stay there for very good reason. So find them and benefit from them.